I started in a, a startup tech company. Actually, I started in politics. I uh, loathed it. I worked on a campaign for a while. And so I decided, you know, I didn't like it, so I decided to go for something more honest. So I moved to Hollywood. And after Hollywood, <laughs> I decided, um, I mean, actually, during when I was uh, NBC Page, I was seating people on The Tonight Show uh, with Jay Leno. So I was giving tours and seating people. That's when I actually got the call for Red Rising to find that Random House didn't just buy the first book, they wanted to buy three. And at that point, I was living on an air mattress in the valley uh, that belonged to my political science professor who was sweet enough to put me up because I had no money. And I couldn't even take girls on dates. I'd take girls on dates like <laughs> Chipotle. It's sad, sad time. But now, I don't have an air mattress. I do, I have the same air mattress for guests, but life has changed. I like running water. Something about it soothes me. If, ideally, it'd be by a river. If I had my druthers, I'd be on an island somewhere with no humans in sight and lots of coconuts. Or fog. Probably fog. Fog is more conducive to writing than coconuts. I would actually create a hybrid writer. Michael Crichton meets J.K. Rowling. And I would use it actually to create a political platform that people could believe in.